Welcome to my channel, dear one. My name is Camilla. And I hope whenever and wherever we are connecting through this video that you are doing great. And through this transmission, you will receive whatever is in the highest good for you at this moment. And so, dear ones, once there was a very wise man who said that our deepest fear is not that we are inadequate. Our deepest fear is that we are powerful beyond measure. And just feel into those great words said by Nelson Mandela. And just... taste them. So what they are truly saying, and what I find very, very true, is that we do not fear that we are not good enough, that we are not enough, that we are, we do not fear our littleness. So what we truly, truly fear is our greatness, is our full potential, is to realize an awakening to who we truly are and to discover discover by that what we are here to do and to be and that is why i'm here and why i'm doing this i really want to guide you and help you to discover your full potential to be who you came here to be and to remember who you are and your own greatness, your own creative force. So this video is about self-sabotaging because when we, we have, as so many generations before us, been taught that we are to, to, to depend on and rely on outer forces to tell us what is wrong and right, uh, what is good, what is bad, and so forth and so on. So we are <clears throat> being brought up to not trust, not listen to our own internal guiding systems. We all have that inner guiding system. We have just turned it off, turned it off. And that is all changing because we are now being asked to start listening, start paying attention to that inner voice and to follow that guidance. And that might be very, very scary. So when we are starting to get the sense of our full potential, we are letting go of our old ways that has been very comforting and very secure. It's very, it's been very, felt very safe for us to give away our power to let everybody else tell us what to do and what not to. So when we are starting to discover who we truly are, <clears throat> many times we are finding ourselves on an unconscious level, sabotaging for ourselves to not rise, to keep ourselves small. Because we know safety, we know our littleness, we do not know our greatness. Because we came here and we agree to forget to be in this physical form, in this density. But now we are waking up. And it's great to stretch our wings, to try out our wings, just find out that we got wings. And it's at the same time scary, right? Uh, so just... I think that you will start to 
after this session to be aware of where you are playing small where you are fear fearing your own greatness your where you are not accepting who you are fully where you are closing your ears and your eyes to not listen to that inner guiding system telling you the truth we are multidimensional beings and we are here to discover our, our gifts and that is what's happening when we are waking up when we are activating our true and every layer of our true self every dimension you will find out all your superpowers and yes it might be scary it might be scary because it's it's unknown territory for us as human beings but not for the one your true self who I'm actually is talking to here beyond your mind who knows what I'm talking about and who is activated by the frequency in what I'm saying and by you being here with me in this moment whenever this moment is for you so don't uh, it doesn't matter if you get what I'm saying or not if you understand it or not and that's the beauty with light language and that's why it's such a great tool I will do a video more about what it actually is later on you don't need to understand the part of you who knows our awakening our remembering all right so today I got with me the beautiful Syrian beings masters of healing masters of light who will help us to clear these subconscious strategies where we are sabotaging for ourselves, where we are fearing our greatness, the blockages we have to keep us small, to awaken to our greatness. And then we will bring, I will bring in the uh, beautiful Lecturians to bring you healing softness remembrance all right okay dear ones so just coming to ease release in whatever form suits you and just let go of everything i just said let go of every mental activity that is going on right now and just be open and willing to receive be willing to embrace more of your true self to wake up to your full power the limitless you who has the unlimited power to create heaven and earth and to let go of playing small we are not here to play small those days are over it's time to rise dear ones it's time to shine So now we start with a clearing and I bring in the beautiful Syrian beings to help us to clear and cleanse for near so ikinia traya nor kiana ratakia partikia narakia tanaya tarkia hurakia naraya taraki kirki ku foramanaya Ashkur kunu yo artakia paramani artakia rananana nai kufuna martakia watanayati. 
So this is deeply rooted in the bloodline. We actually literally had this in our DNA, and so it has to be cleared out in our DNA. To reactivate our DNA. To return it to its original blueprint. So I am an ayahuacu, a rapatan, an artakia, who are maniatra, yatakia, narakia, takia, arkia, tu, rapatia, narakia, narata, who are ratakini, artakia. Just let go. And if there is fear coming up, just hand it over to your higher self, your family of light, this guide who has been guiding you here, who is overseeing everything and supporting you because they know it's the right time for you just trust Uruvu aparta kia narataya kurkunoyo torutu akiaranaya. Just let go, release into Mother Earth. Let all limiting beliefs, all blockages, return to its point of origin. To source light kurkunoyo water. We say, let go, partana yaut. O kiatana, orana i partini autat. Arana yatana, urkototu furman yarate. Karana ya atiatarana, kianarati, arata kiana, torutu atiana, torutu antiana tati, arkana ya tukana ya. And you can just shake a little bit if you want to <sighs> integrate energies and shake off some old energies. <sighs> and we will now bring in the beautiful Ecturian healing team to bring softness to you, trust on your path. path. And they're saying it's not that serious. The Syrians are a bit more serious. So they want you to, to feel the playfulness and the, the um, joy of returning to yourself. Remember. They really want you to remember that it's something good, it's a good thing. You have nothing to fear. And I ask you to trust. They ask you to trust. Trust is key. Just feel those beautiful beings around us. And just as the Syrians, they come with this blue light. Just feel surrounded by the blue turquoise light like they're wrapping you in a soft blanket and it's time for you to remember it's time for you to know yourself know thyself so this is an activating an activation of your higher heart. It's also connected with your soul star chakra. So just go into your heart space, your higher heart. This is here, actually. Urkiana titinia. 
So just feel this activation, this healing, unity and oneness. Remembrance of you, your full potential, all the dimensions of who you are, all your gifts, and what you came here to be. Amaniya kitiya nara tatiya ya ikitiya. Akinriya tikiya wawatiya mana ya ihiniya atinriya tikiya wanaya na. Surku ya na ya tiya na atikiya na. Ia nitiya na ukiya na. Ia wawapiarta. Uwa na ya kiya na tati. No, to. Infusing the throat chakra for you to stand in your power, in your truth, internally and externally communicating your truth. Being aware of your truth. Hufur pati kurunu yu arana ki tiriata na hiria hufur mumo narka utarata kiana hiniana rata nar sufur tati kiana yu tanaya tikiya or kufunu yono na sarti ki or tukuayana hititiana. Ha o ikiar sauti tiniana ya miro wa papa mania wa tikiana ya ati amarana ya ora tikiana ra tikiana or soyana ti amana ya na na istor tukuayana ya open up your throat and know the time has shifted So the most important message they got for you right now is that now, dear ones, it is safe to be your full potential. It's safe to stand in your power, to feel your truth, to know your truth, and to express your truth as actually the world, humanity, is needing this from you. And we know dear ones they're saying it's not it has not always been safe. But remember there, there is a shift that has occurred. Trust that it is safe. It is safe. Trust and just feel into your expansiveness. Allow your chest area, your heart, and your high heart to expand. They are showing me um, like a, a clo clothing that has always been <clears throat> too big for you. But what they show me is that now when you will try it on, you will see that it fits. Because you are expanding, you are becoming your full potential. And it's time to allow yourself to upgrade. And they also say that they know there is very much fear around this in our DNA, in our selves, cells, due to the past. <clears throat> and uh, they will assist us in uh, more clearing in this, all right? So I agree, <laughs> there will be more clearings and more activations. 
Right, dear ones, so this is it for now. And they also say that they will keep on working with you if you agree to, and they will download more tonight when you are sleeping. And don't worry, it will be very gentle. And if you don't want that, you can just say no thank you, or rather yes please, if that is your wish. Alright dear ones, I hope this served you. And I hope that you are ready and willing to be powerful beyond measure. Because that is who you are. Okay. So I send you love. I send you blessings. See you soon. Thank you.